Hello everyone. Just stay back and listen for a few minutes and uh, tell me if I'm wrong. But uh, today I'm going to talk about artificial intelligence. When this thing happens, we don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. I'm starting in a wrong way. Uh, our ways of life is going to change. And we are knowingly getting ourselves involved into this artificial intelligence that will start taking over the world, which I am sure. Because one nutty, uh, what do you call, IT engineer will have the knowledge of starting a revolution on one of the robots, making the robot into a, a super intelligent master card. And uh, what will happen is that super intelligent MasterCard will take over the world because we, our scientists have put a satellite in the uh, orbit and this robot can change the whole world how it's going to be. I may be talking rubbish, but just listen for one, just Think about it for once. What if, you see, we are having automatic electric uh, motors now. That will change the uh, into intelligent, artificial intelligence. And it will take us anywhere we want. Uh, eventually, we'll have uh, what you call robots in our house doing the job what human beings are doing. We'll be empty, we'll be having no job at all. And we will enjoy every bit of it until they started taking over our life. We won't need a wife or husband because uh, artificial intelligence robot can do the job for us. Artificial insemination, robot will do it. They can actually do the job for us. We won't need a wife or a husband. We can, uh, we'll be living like a dummy in a house. I'm not talking about today or tomorrow. I'm talking about maybe 20 or 30 years on, maybe even more, but it is going to come. And these robots will take over the world and we can't stop them because they will uh, have the sense to understand what we are thinking and do according to what we are thinking. That's the type of job the robots will do, this artificial intelligence. So for their own survival, this robots will start recharging themselves. We won't, they won't need us to charge them to become a, a, a workable. They will learn to recharge themselves. They'll take the plug and plug it on and charge themselves. That's the way it's going to be. And uh, once this master mind has been made into a, uh, into a, uh, what do you call, a super intelligent, then this mastermind can control all the robots in the whole world and take over. There won't be a president, there won't be a prime minister anywhere. It'll all be taken over. 
because everybody will be so lazy to do any job at all. We might just drink ourselves to die. There might not be another human being because the farmers, the, uh, uh, what do you call the place where they kill the animals to, for, a, for our meat and all, they'll start using uh, automation like this. And then the robot cannot tell from a human being and and the animal. The, they're all uh, living creatures, and they'll start killing us for the meat and feeding us, feeding us with our own meat. We never know what's going to happen. But these are things you have to think about. This is the future I'm talking about. And these IT engineers should think about it and stop. I mean, the uh, robots can do all the engineering work. They'll uh, build the infrastructure for the rebuilding of robots. And the whole world will be filled with robots. And what else? That they won't need any doctors in the hospital or nurses, will they? Just imagine, they are using them now as nurses. And then going forward, they're not going backward, they're not shutting it down or anything. They're enjoying that uh, side help they are getting from the robots, these artificial intelligence. They are not just, they are not going to be just artificial intelligence, they are going to be our natural life span. They will take over our world, our life, our way of living. And we won't have any life left. The planet will become uh, frozen or uh, melted down by the heat coming up, two degree more heat on the, to the world. Gosh, what next? These are the things we have to think about. I mean, it won't happen during my time or the time of the people who are uh, my age and uh, below me, uh, above 60 and all. Such people will, it won't affect because we'll be dead and gone. But think about our children and our grandchildren. They will see the future more than what we can see. They will see what's going to happen when they are old enough to understand. When they get to our age, They'll see the difference, but we won't be there to see what's happening. We can only, uh, maybe our soul can see it. But what are we going to do about it? The only thing we can do about it is slow down the process of, of uh, this artificial intelligence. Architects, they'll, they'll, be, uh, they'll do the work for us. I mean, we won't need a house, will we? The robots will take over the houses. The houses will be all demolished like there was no, there's no use for it because there's no human being to live in. It is very frightening. And I know it could happen. Don't think I'm an utter, but just think it could happen to anyone. It could happen to this world. The whole world will suffer with the intelligence of artificial action. And there's nothing you or me can do anything about it. I may be a nutter, but the fact is that just think about it for a few minutes. See if uh, I'm telling the truth. Some people might say yes, 
and some may say, what is he talking about? But let me tell you one thing. We never thought about electric cars in our time when we were young. We, had, we uh, only started seeing the television when we were young. We never saw any television. There were no television, there's no Wi-Fi, there's no, there wasn't any uh, mobile phones or anything. Look at it now. Mobile phone, you can talk to anyone in the world without any cost or charges. WhatsApp messages. That's what's happening now. So just imagine when during our time when we were young, what happened? Nothing. We went out and played and came home at uh, maybe seven o'clock, nine o'clock. And uh, nobody was any wiser. And that time we didn't have any automation, no artificial intelligence either. All we had was our parents to guide us. And we went out and played and we uh, went to each other's house and we ate from each other's house and there was no communication of who is, who, whom are you eating from? You know, like uh, there was no religious matter to any one of us. We didn't care about religion. We didn't care about caste. We went to everybody's place and ate. And our Grandmother used to say, Ayo, don't let that person into the house. And that was wrong those days. And we took it as that they didn't know what they were talking about. But today, we are free to go in anybody's house. We can go and enjoy. And now, our system is changing and we are going to stand back and watch the automation taking over. All the cooking will be done by them. Plumbing, heating water, if we want, when we want them. They will recognize the sound of ours. They will they are recognizing it now, our sound. And the mobile phone is picking up our face to recognize our face. And uh, uh, password uh, is being used as a, our face or our thumb fingerprint. Those are artificial in intelligence. And it's not going to change anymore. It's not going to go back. It's going forward. And our future depends on such people who are going to produce an intelligent robot. And we, can, we have nothing and we can do nothing about it. And the government won't do anything because they are lazy as it is. <laughs> so what do you think they'll do? They are trying to bring in artificial intelligence. And they don't know what's going to happen. Nuclear weapons will be fired at any time. It doesn't matter where the, it's going. It might be going to Russia, India, Pakistan, or any America, they may not be Europe. Europe uh, will be destroyed at a click of a button. England will sink into the water. England is uh, only a small island. It will just disappear into the water. And who is to blame for the, all this? The evolution 
or revolution of the robots that we are building. We ourselves are destroying ourselves. We will have uh, we will have the intelligence to re- remove such things happening in the future. But we won't do it. We will carry on and try. Everyone will try to be who is best, who is the better person than me. Uh, will I have? Will I make a better uh, intelligent, art, artificial intelligent uh, robot, better than the next person? That will be the challenge now. The scientists will start all over again. They are the ones who send this orbit into outer space, and those orbits are going to listen to these robots. and we will have no say in it take care everybody just think about it i'm not saying it's going to be true but it could happen couldn't it